Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Black Geyser with me, Brangaton. So if I clicked for I'm me always ready. that these are magical traps and that Biala needs to disarm them, not Hamlin. Are you certain? That's why he kept failing. I'm listening at once. Alright, let's head down to the next level. Descend deeper into the bowels of Emmanuel's horde. Or Emmanuel's arena now. I'm thy stone. I await. I shall not flag yes. until we prevail. I'll make it. Hmm? Off I go. Yes. All right, we'll focus fire. And drop a buff. What is your wish? A beer would be nice. I'm Thank always you. ready. You're in my way. I'm listening. What do you need? What do you wish of me? All right, so attacking Helgenhar, I'm going to focus Go a few buffs on him. I must ready. only ask. A beer would be nice. Thank you. We'll find a solution. All right, some acid supply mess up the machinery. At least that's the hope. Alright, they don't seem that tough. What next? I'm going. I'll marry you! Shield me! Yes. Alright, one more corrosive bolt, I think. I await your instructions. A lot of experience for that. 1850. At once. Mm -hmm. I wish that sound would go away. Off I go. This is considered a magical and regular trap. You need all there. That's neat. Let's go to quick save. We're we'll running across something more dangerous than golems. Whatever you say. So we've seen Widowmaker before. I think it's sold in Darren Gold. It's saying that Widowmaker has more damage, but I lose the physique and focus. This also gives me permafrost once per day. This gives me summon spider one per day. Oh, it's also a two-handed sword, not a one-handed. It's not a long sword. I will lead. So it's a downgrade for Helgenhar since he'd lose access to his shoe. No one stands against steel. What do you wish of me? We'll find a solution. I don't want to waste all my offense yet, unless I'm thinking about it. I'll go ahead and use my free severing sparkle and wolf summon. Oh, actually pulled a bunch of skeletons too. By a bunch, I mean two. I'm ready.
Oh, does he only do pulse and blow damage? So I think both Helgenhar and... What do you need? I mean, character have over 100% pulse and blow mm -hmm. resist. I'm listening. In fact, Helgenhar should be immune to all physical damage. Flashing, stabbing, pulse and blow. You need only ask. Ready to serve. I await your instructions. As you say. All right, another quick save. I fear neither pain nor death. I'm always ready. Are you certain? Yes. For Alnerius! I'm listening. What is your wish? You need only ask. I will lead. I'll oh, finish cutting out the arena proper before we head backstage. You dare face me? Yes, let's see. I await your instruction. Your Surrender come. while you still can. I'm listening. Off also, I we go. have two ways out of the arena. Go ahead. Go ahead. Bring it defending. Whatever you say. Ready to serve. Go ahead. Be a little tricky trying to get all this stuff out of Emmanuel's horde in one trip. What do you need? I'm gonna try it. Ready to serve. I'm listening. I'm ready. Whatever you say. Hmm? We'll see how it goes. Hmm? Okay, that was to be expected. So Ceremonial Dark Glaive, it is cursed, so it currently gives us minus one to physique, minus one to focus, 3% crit chance, and on hit chance to inflict fog with suffocation to self, 10%. Dark Glaives are finally made halberds cursed by servants of the dark for use in human sacrifices. The curse upon this particular weapon is especially potent. Anyone who takes it in hand risks dire corruption. Good for us, yes. we have... It's a rock going hand. Just a 4% to crit chance. Alright, doesn't seem particularly good. At once. You dare face me! What do you agreed? I really don't need to waste spells on this guy since he just can't kill my front line. We have all the time in the world. A beer would be nice. Thank you. Hmm?
You need only ask. All right, another golem down. Another locked container. The ring of defending. What do you need? There? All right, what's that to make do with the slowed party, it looks like. Uh, what Hamlin, go ahead and take care of this. I don't plan on leaving anything behind if I can help it. We'll find a solution. All right, so I think this is the first time we've seen enemy to friend, or maybe we did, I just didn't buy it earlier. Uh, do you even need allies when your enemies are this helpful? Turns one phone to a temporary friend. I await your instructions. Go ahead. Right, another sharpshooter's pride and woodland breastplate. Plus thirty-five percent to stabbing resist. Plus twenty-five percent to pulse and blow and heat resist. Plus 15% to slashing and cold resist. This cures consists of a light metal breastplate, a backplate, and two small arm guards. Oven blacksmiths created this piece to serve not only swordsmen, but rangers as well, as it allows a wide range of motion for the arms and hips. I'm listening, as you say. We also what found next? that amulet. The Emerald Keepstone. I think this is new. This useful necklace allows a wizard to store three simple spells within that and each be cast once a day. Given to spellweavers who have graduated from the College of Ford and Haft, they're a fairly common magical item. I'm always ready. I mean, it serves the same function, but it sounds like this is supposed to be for the wizard or a spellweaver, and this should be for the clerics and templars. Swap that out. What is your wish? Another ring of lies. A lot more you of the same. Only ask. Ring of Lies is better than this, but I'm gonna keep this equipped because it's more thematic. I await your instructions. A beer would be nice. Thank you. So the ornate tower shield, plus 24% to slashing, stabbing, and pulse and blow resist. Heavy tower shield made from wood, reinforced with metal plates. The size of this shield makes it extremely unwieldy, which results in it only really being reliably, reliably use, usable geez, for armies moving in a phalanx, turtle, or similar formation. Its surface area is great enough to completely cover a human-sized user, but movement while carrying it is hindered greatly. The shield features a pair of pointed tips on its underside. They can be thrusted into the ground for even more stability. Or an unfortunate adversary for a satisfactory takedown. Hmm? There? Let's go to quick save. One side trap. I'm ready. I'm Ran listening. Right, we'll run right back out of it. <laughs>
Have a fun time sorting mm -hmm. this inventory once we leave this place. You need only ask. Let's check his stock of what arrows real wish? quick. Looks like we're gonna come to blows with this group up here. I don't see why we wouldn't. What do you wish of me? I'm ready. Yes. I await your instructions. A beer would be nice. Thank you. Yes. Oh, he is completely over encumbered. All right. I'm listening. I'm I'll make it. I await your instructions. Another quick save and off I go. I'm listening. All right, this looks like a proper boss fight. Let's go ahead and buff up. Go ahead. Hmm? We'll find a solution. Ready to serve. I'm listening. You need only ask. What next? All right, I think that's say. enough for now. Hmm? Me. A beer yes. would be nice. Thank you. That's right, good. Quick save and approach. Lord Emmanuel himself. As you say. Sakti. Who dares intrude upon my magnificent treasury? I just straight up kill him? This world belongs to the living, pitiful creature. I banish you from this plane. I banish you. Rah! Uh, not the kind of tactic you want to go halfway on, Donald. <laughs> this is not good. Oh, it didn't work. <laughs> no one stands against steel. Maybe that skill just I'm isn't ready. high enough? Yes. I'm listening. Well, so be Surrender it. while you still <laughs> can. What do you wish of me? All right, let's get the pool of blood if we can. Right. Yes, are you certain? Go ahead. Of course. Down, villain. I'm ready. Good news is they're lined up perfectly for a fireball right here. I'm always ready. As well as. One of these guys. This ends now. What next? She can get a little closer. Hmm? Here. I keep circling this way. Alright, so he looks relatively well armored. Let's go ahead and throw this on him. To do a lot of heat damage. What did you wish? Yes. From the shadows, I'm he always ready. Actually, I sent Sraka back here to protect yes. my back line. A beer. Off I go. <laughs> hmm? I'm gonna try waylay I'm with listening. main character while well, he's challenging how with Helgenhar. Whoops. What do you wish of me? I'm gonna put shielded, or I guess mystic bulwark on Soraka. Because she's being focused right now. Go to Crippling Ray on Lord Emmanuel himself. What is you? Like so, and like so. Oh, that's my spell. 
Like, what is... <laughs> what was manifesting back there? We'll find a solution. I'm pretty sure that was... Incense of Soraya. I await your instructions. Marathi. I'm ready. What next? All right, healing mist just to be safe. We'll try the stun. Yes. Ready Oops, to Raka, serve. keep yourself alive. You need only ask. Wait, what is going on mm -hmm. here? At once. I await your instructions. I will lead. Not sure why the wolves were hostile to me. Go ahead. And see any negative effects on my characters. Alright, either way, we got two level ups uh, Helgenhar, Brewing and Drying, Outdoor Survival, and. Large Blades. A beer would be nice. Thank Amlin, you. Bargain and Persuasion. No, Learning and Research. Uh, pick Locks and Hide and Sneak. And max out small blades. You need only ask. All right, we got armor of the ravenous lord. Going to grab that. A uh, gloomy legs, another piece of the other quest. Looks like that might be it. I'm ready. We'll find a solution. A beer would be nice. Thank you. Yes. Whatever you say. Who is carrying? Ahead. What is your wish? There it is. So we need to give that to Soraka. Yes. Hmm. Ready to serve. Well, let's see what the debuff is before we get rid of the curse. Alright, so Armor of the Ravenous Lord. Plus 40% to Pulse and Blow and Slashing Resist. Plus 30% to Stabbing, Heat, Cold, and Illusion and Manipulation. And Arousal Resistance. Plus 5 to Physique, minus 2 to Charisma, minus 1 to Focus, and minus 10 to Maximum Health. This armor set belonged to the Great Lord Emmanuel, often called the greediest man who ever lived. As Emmanuel's raging avarice overpowered his mind, he secluded himself from the outside world in the depths of his dungeon, which he outfitted with every comfort and where he kept his greatest treasures. From that day, no one heard of him again, yet none but the bravest of adventurers will venture near his lair, for any who dares set foot within vanishes without a trace, forever. No expense was spared in the creation of his beautiful armor, which has never witnessed the horrors of combat, but as his mind deteriorated, so did his plate, lo so did his plate lose its shine. In the end, Manuel's curse claimed his beloved armor as well. Though its beauty has faded over the decades, its enchantments haven't waned in the slightest. So she does not have the skill yet. there so we will hold off on that for now what next because we don't have a choice what is your wish i'm list off i go a hamlet is once again overburdened would be nice thank you hmm at once
think we already looted these. Yeah. Okay. So two paths to check out. We'll start with this one, and then we'll check out the other one. Alright, let's give it a quick save. I shall not flag until we prevail. What do you wish of me? Ready to serve. I'm hanging there, buddy. You need only ask. I await your instructions. Go ahead. All right, uh, Soraka, learning and research, abolish curses, and small blades. Yes. Then we'll try this again. There we go. That was one point away. Okay, so the resistances have changed slightly. Slashing went up to 50 from 40, unless I misread it previously. Uh, we still have plus 4 to physique, I think it was plus 5 previously, uh, plus 2 to focus instead of a minus, no effect on charisma, and plus 30 to maximum health. How does that compare to... I'm listening. What next? I'm always ready. I await your instructions. It mostly seems like an upgrade across the board. If we lose that aim and accuracy, the dodge chance, and season warrior, which is fine. We can give that to Helgen Har instead. Go ahead. I'm listening. Hmm? What do you need? We'll find a solution. I'm ready. Too much stuff to carry back to the top. We're going to. So who can't I move? I think I it's just lead. Biala. All right. Yes. Hmm. Go ahead. I'm always ready. What next? What do you wish of me? You need, as you say. Still, so much more to take. <laughs> I'm ready. Hmm. All right. I need to give some of the lighter stuff to Hamlin, and then put all the heavy stuff into my main character's inventory. Hmm. So he doesn't get bogged down. Whatever you say. All right. Go ahead. I'm listening. All right, did that go into my inventory or did that go somewhere else? Whatever you say. Ready to serve. What is your wish? Soul twist. Spell calls forth the malevolent spirit to haunt a hostile target. Each turn, the spirit meddles with the target's mind, causing alternating waves of panic or apathy to wash over them. Yes. I don't think yeah, we haven't seen that before. You need only ask. A beer. All right, all right. I await. Off I go. That's right, there's still hostiles in here. <laughs> well, do you oh man, yes. this is getting I'm ready. Burdensome. Alright, uh Tormentor. Another cursed piece of equipment. 
So plus 40% to stabbing resist, plus 30% to pulse and blow and heat resist, plus 20% to slashing and cold resist, minus 20% to strain and pain resist, minus 2 to physique, plus 3 to dexterity, and effects on being hit, chance to deal 1 stabbing damage to self, 100%. The rivets holding this breastplate together jut out sharply from the inner surface. These claw-like protrusions are the result of a curse and cause continuous pain to the wearer. The curse also forces the unfortunate owner to seek out situations to inflict even more pain upon themselves. What next? A beer would be nice. Thank you. Hmm? Go ahead. What do you wish of me? Ready to serve. All right, it's been purified. How does that change the effects? So we lost the negative resistance. I forgot what it was for already. Uh, it gives plus one to physique and plus two to dexterity now. And the rest of the resistances look about the same. And losing one dexterity for one physique, I think is worth it. I don't have that chance to inflict lightning to my party. I think that's still a tough call. I think I'll hold on to Scooty Optus just in case. Alright, we're so close to being done with this place, but I'm going to call the episode here anyway, and in the next one we will finish carrying out Emmanuel's arena. Since we just took down Lord Emmanuel himself, I doubt there's going to be another level to this place, but you never know. Either way, thanks for watching. Ask. I'll see you guys in the next one.